millions of people in Syria and Iraq are at risk of losing access to water, electricity, and food. This comes amid rising temperatures, record low water levels due to a lack of rainfall, and a drought. International aid groups warned of this on Monday, 17-1-2022. Reported by The Independent, the two neighboring countries have been hit by years of conflict and mismanagement. They need urgent action to combat severe water shortages. Drought also disrupts electricity supply due to low water levels impacting dams. In turn, this impacts critical infrastructure, including health facilities. More than 12 million people in both countries are affected, including 5 million in Syria who are directly dependent on the Euphrates River. In Iraq, loss of access to water from the Euphrates and Tigris rivers, as well as drought, threatens at least 7 million people. About 400 square kilometers, 154 square miles, of farmland are facing drought, the group said. Two dams in northern Syria, which supply power to 3 million people, will soon be closed. Karsten Hansen, regional director for the Norwegian Refugee Council, said that for hundreds of thousands of Iraqis and Syrians, the ongoing water crisis will soon become an unprecedented catastrophe. This catastrophe is driving more people to move, he said. Other aid groups including Mercy Corps the Danish Refugee Council, Care International, acted in action against hunger have also warned. They warned that several Syrian provinces, including Hasaka, Aleppo and Raqqa in the north, and Deir el-Zor in the east, had seen an increase in waterborne diseases. The area includes refugee settlements housing tens of thousands of people displaced in Syria's 10-year conflict.